Hello friends, this video on water a precious resource part 6 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So now we got to know the reasons which lead to water scarcity. Now needless to discuss why do we need to manage these resources, especially a, res a resource which is as precious as water. So one reason is the resources are limited. So if you talk about water, the sources of water, they are limited. So we can get limited amount of water either through rainfall or from the water reservoirs or from the underground storage. So basically the amount of water which we have that is limited. Ensure equal distribution of resources to all. So if you talk about water, we have to ensure that same amount of water gets equally distributed to all the people. Uh, now what happens is in some areas water is available in good amount. I mean there is no scarcity of water. Now people living in those areas, they tend to waste a lot of water. So many a times they just leave their tap open. So a lot of water get wasted. So they do waste water in various ways. Whereas in some areas water is not at all there. So people are struggling there just to get some amount of water. So this scenario should not happen. So we need to ensure that equal distribution of water takes place in all the places. Protect the environment. That is very important because our in for the sustenance of our environment, all the natural resources, including water, play a very important role. So management of all natural resources is important and hence is water management also important. Now, water is of the basic necessity of all living forms. If water is not there, life would not exist on the earth. And human intervention has resulted in scarcity of water. So this is the most important point to be noted here because we can work in order to improve this part because it is we who are responsible for this. So what are the things that we can do? We can stop deforestation. We should plant more and more trees because if we have more parks, more gardens, we have more soil, so water penetration would be more. There will be more groundwater. We should stop wastage of water because it is very precious. So you should not leave the tap open while you are brushing your teeth or you should not waste a lot of water while taking bath or while cooking food. So just take care that there is no leakage in any of the pipes or there is no problem with your taps that water keeps leaking through it all the time. So all these small small things can be taken care of to stop wastage of water. To stop wastage of water that is one thing that we can do. Second thing is plant trees and stop deforestation. That is another thing that we can do. Third thing is population control. Now, if the population keeps on increasing like this, the way it is happening right now. Now, however, it has been controlled to some extent now, but still the population is very huge. So if number of people keeps increasing like this, in that case, the amount of water resources that we have will never be able to meet the demand of the ever growing population. So it is very important to control the population. So these are some of the things that we can do to from our end to control water scarcity. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.